All right, guys, it's your boy SSW Dinger, and today I am here to talk about the uh, unfortunate death of YouTuber Keemstar, aka Jarmana. Now, I'm going to be honest with you guys, um, this has, um, this is very uncomfortable. I don't like talking about um, people's death, I don't like um, making content on. Uh, the death of fellow YouTubers or just anyone in, in, in uh, general, especially if it's just for views. Um, however, I'm actually a big fan of Keemstar. I've been following Keemstar for or on YouTube and anything else for the last like maybe ten years. Not following him, I don't follow him on Instagram, but like I've been subscribed to the channel for the last ten years, watching a lot of his content. You know, um, just a lot of his updates and everything else. I've always been a big fan for quite some time, so. When I heard that he passed away earlier on on YouTube, on, on Instagram, I said, this has to be fake. Especially over the fact that it was on April the 1st, April Fool's Day. When I heard that he passed away today on April Fool's Day, I said, nah, this has to be a fake. This has to be a joke. Um, I went on the social media, I went on all of the social medias. I went on YouTube. I went absolutely everywhere to make sure that this wasn't a lie. And... To some extent, I still feel like, um, I don't know, it just, it just feels like it's just so random. It's so random and, yeah, to some extent, I'm just hoping that um, this may be some April Fool's prank, prank. But to what I'm seeing, um, you know, it doesn't seem to be the case. So I'm going to be sharing it with you guys. Um, like I say, I'm not going to lie to you. If I find out that this is a prank, this is going to be the worst April Fool's prank anyone can ever do especially to their fans their family and their friends i really hope it isn't um also don't question why i'm up so late what reason yeah so we're gonna get into the reason that's why he passed away and guys if you're watching some youtube or kick or um twitch make sure you follow me on all platforms uh for more videos like not not like this but like just for more live content um gaming and you know stuff like that once again, um, before we get into too much though, I do want to um, say rest in peace, Keemstar, condolences to his family, his friends, his loved ones. Um, and yeah, like I say, um, from what I've kind of grew up watching him do and everything on, on social media, I haven't ever seen anything bad said about this guy in any way, shape or form to my knowledge anyway. So, you know, shout out to him for that one. Uh, let's go. I'm gonna share my screen with you guys. I'm gonna go check his uh, Instagram just to get into as to how um, pretty much he passed away. So there we are with sharing screens. Um, if you go on this YouTube, uh, well his Instagram, as you can see. Uh, yeah. So let's go read this. And guys, I'm gonna struggle reading. You know, listen. I, for the people who know me, you know I can't read for shit. For the people that don't know me, hey, I can't read for shit. But anyway, um, on his uh, page, John Muller, it says, it is with deep sorrow to, to, that we share um, the news of Keem's last passing. He peacefully departed last night in his sleep, um, su succumbing to complications from a plum plumery? What does it say? Plumery. Whatever my girlfriend said, plumery. What's that word? Ignore us, you can't read it yourself. Anyway, our heart, don't, no excuses. Our hearts ache um, for his family and friends as they neg um, navigate um, this profound loss. In the light of Kim's of passing, the drama alert news will, team will be temporarily dissolving as we take time to mourn and restructure. We appreciate um, your understanding during this challenging period. Kim Jong was a um, pioneer figure in on uh, in, on, in online social media or online media known for his dedication to you know it's so hilarious I feel like when I'm done in this and I see the comment people's gonna be like mate <laughs> the same <laughs> hold on people's gonna be more focused on my terrible reading than the person's death and this is why this is this is why I didn't want to make this because I said you know when you talk about news you gotta read the facts you gotta do this you gotta do that I can't read for shit anyway Let's continue. Oh, by the way, guys, if you're new to the channel, 
in my last stream, my girlfriend's normally in the back behind the green screen. So yeah, that's what I'm talking to. I'm not talking to myself. Anyway, so dedicate dedication to reporting news and um, fostering dialogue within the community. Keeps that impact will be felt far and wide, and its legacy will endure though undone through the countless lives he touched. Kim's legacy lives on through his daughter Mao. Okay, cool. So first of all, first of all, I just didn't know he had a daughter. You know, I didn't even know. Let me type in Kim Star daughter. Hey, it's how old is she? How old is she? Apparently, she's four. Four, my daughter. Oh wow, one of this person. No, that was nine years ago. Okay, so four plus nine that would be six thirty. Thirteen, I believe. Yeah, thirteen. Anyway. So you was asking as to uh, how you passed away. It was due to this word that I cannot pronounce. Let's go on Google and, and see if they can explain to us as to how or what, what this means. And hopefully uh, I will be able to read these words. Hold on. Let me see. Okay. A, whatever this word says, is a blood clot. Oh. It's a blood clot that uh, blocks and stops blood flow to an artery in the lung. Artery in the lung. Um, in most cases, the blood clot starts in, you know the word blood blood clot. I can't help but almost sound like I'm saying blood clot. <laughs> and then um, the blood clot starts in a deep vein in the leg, and travels to the lung. Rarely, the clot forms in a vein um, and in another part of the body. So once again, basically, it's a it's a it's a blood clot. It's something that pretty much blocks the blood from flowing. So as you can see in this image, oh, let's go to images. I can see some of the images here. This, here we are, a better one. Over here, let's say the blood will kind of thicken and it will prevent the blood but blood flow going around um, smoothly around the lungs and, you know, other places. And that can prevent certain important areas from, you know, receiving blood. And uh, you can pretty much pass away from it. It's actually quite a serious thing. I actually got a friend who had a bl blood clot. And he, I think he had it on his way back home from Jamaica. So on his way back from on holiday, um, his thing kind of suffered capped him on the plane and the moment he landed at the airport he had to go straight to the hospital he uh, used to box for one of the gyms I boxed at but um, yeah anyway like I say the reason why to some extent right, I was thinking it has to be fake news because when I went on uh, YouTube and I typed in Keemstar death I'm thinking this would be absolutely everywhere why is no one talking about it it's not on the news no one's posted it it just doesn't make sense and this is why I'm thinking, bro, like, this must be a, like, kind of troll. You know what I'm saying? And I'm really, really hoping that this is a troll. But, um, like I say, just in case uh, it's not fake news, we're still going to pay our respects for, um, you know, Keemstar. And, uh, you know, like I say, um, hope he rests, uh, hope his soul rest in peace and his family, obviously, are healing. Um, it blocked his um, respiratory, whatever that says. Okay, well, it's Miss Spiper. Why, why do you read for me, huh? Guys, this is why, to some extent, you should. Uh, I'm not going to necessarily say stay in school, but you know what I'm saying? Read the books. Systems so or parts of his body didn't get, get the right oxygen, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's what it sounds like it was. Uh, but anyway, like I said, I don't want to. I don't really want to talk about this kind of stuff uh, for too long. I'll be honest with you. I don't like talking about death. Um, so we're going to keep this one short. I can't say short and sweet because there's nothing sweet about what's going on. But we're going to keep this one maybe short. And um, we're going to say one last time, rest in peace to Kim Dharma and his family. And um, I'm sorry, con condolences to his friends and family and loved ones. May his soul rest in peace. And once again, I hope this is not a prank. Because if this is a prank, when I say to you, if this is a prank... If it's a prank and he's alive, I swear to you, I would myself would fly to America and punch his face. Like, generally speaking, this, yeah. Anyway, let's just hope it's a prank. It happened on April Fool's Day. Let's I, hope it is a prank. Huh? You're saying it wrong. Let's hope it is a prank. Oh, snap. Did I say, uh, let's hope it isn't a prank? Yeah. No, but that's the thing. Well, hear me out. I'm hoping that it's a prank, so I'm hoping that he's still alive. But at the same time... It's a dark... It's a dark humor prank. Don't do that. The celebrity that for publicity, that little girl that was nine on it, and then she came back with a whole new look. Um, little Tay, little Tay, something like that. Yeah. So even, even, yeah. Rest in peace, Kim Star again. Yeah. Even what's his name on it the other day? Uh, that boxer. Uh, uh, who's that guy? Um, uh, who's that guy? Um, oh, um, who was it? Who that kid? 
See now, let me share my screen because I boxed on the other day. Uh, let me see, let me see, let me see. What's his name again? Ryan Garcia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you are. Ryan Garcia. Death rumors. He literally done that a week ago, saying that he um is Ryan. Uh, this was look a few years ago. He was talking about the fact that oh people trying to kill him and. And then someone said, yeah, the slice has felt on the social media, done some extra shit. So I'm not going to lie to you, a lot of people do this all the time. And, and um, yeah, when I see like the stuff like this, I'm thinking to myself, this is probably a prank. Um, but I'm hoping that it's not. Hold on, what did Codus just say? Guys, uh, one second, what did, what, what did Codus say? First and first, office boom. There we go. What, what the call to say? Keemstar was a bully and also a main reason why Ed, Etika killed himself. Now I remember Etika. That was the guy that um jumped off the bridge, right? Yeah. That yeah, that's him. Um, I remember. Th I remember that um him and Etika had like a back and forth. Um, and I remember a lot of people was saying. I I actually remember a lot of people saying um a few things about that, but um. You know, I don't want to bring no negativity to uh, someone's passing. I'm not gonna lie to you. Not no matter how bad a person is, once they pass away, just let 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 their soul rest in peace. You don't disrespect the death. Rest in peace. Yeah. Uh, not saying he deserves it, but it goes. But what goes around comes around. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course, of course. I get it, I get it. But you know, at the same time, like I say, uh, it is two different scenarios. One person died from natural causes to some extent. And some person committed suicide. So it's not necessarily the same thing. We can't escape death. That's why even when I hear rappers nowadays talk about someone's death, I always say to them, to myself, "You do know we're all gonna die one day, right?" Like everyone always like, oh, "I'm smoking on this pack, I'm smoking on that pack," and the next minute, a week later, one day, closest friend passes around. It's like, bro, like you know, what I'm saying it's that's not disrespect the dead. Once you do what you gotta do, just leave it as that. I think um, Keemstar was a genuine gen general annoyance. Okay. You know, one thing about Coders, he has no uh, uh, filter. Um, you know, try to uh, respect the dead in uh, every way, shape, and form. Obviously, uh, Kim uh, Coders is like a fifty cent. Uh, if he has a problem with you, whether you're dead or alive, he's going to continue and make the public and everyone know that hey, I have a problem with you. <sighs> anyway, um. Cool. We're not gonna make this. Uh, never heard of him. You never heard of him. Keemstar's a big guy, man. I never heard of him. Anyway, we're not gonna make this uh, too long because um, it's gonna be a short stream. I wasn't even meant to stream today. I just wanted to come and pay my respects on live. As you guys can see, I'm not even streaming on YouTube or um, or on a. Uh, why is my hair sticking out of this? I'm not even streaming on a uh, YouTube or Kick. I just came to uh, stream on Twitch quickly for you guys, and then what I'm gonna do is uh, edit this video real quickly and post it on YouTube later on tonight. So you know, just uh, be sure to go give it a like and uh, yeah. Um, RP, you want me to get him to on hospital? <laughs> nah, nah, you're good, man. Bill Gates got uh, AIDS as well. I never knew that. Bill Gates, I never knew that. Bill Gates doing. I never knew that. Later, you know. But he's a billionaire, anyway, man. Those guys will, you know, pay. They got huh? They got cured Yeah, they got cured from already, man. He's already cured, man. Bill Gates got a. He's cured, man. Anyway, guys, um, listen, I'm gonna leave up to it. Like I said, I wasn't meant to stream tonight. I literally only went live just to um pay some respect to Keemstar. Um, and I'm gonna have to um obviously edit this and then post it in it. But um, like I say. Rest in peace, this guy. Let's hope that uh, this is just a prank. And um, if it's a prank, then it's not a good one. Uh, now, also, as for Boogeyman, I'm going to play it tomorrow. So when I go live tomorrow... Whew, no, sorry. I'm not even sure if I'm going to be going live much this week because I've got a very busy week this week. So when I go live, I may go live like... It may be like little short stuff like this, but nothing long. But I can't be um, going live. But I'll be playing Boogeyman sometime this week. Most probably tomorrow. But um, yeah. I'll upload a clip that's any. Yeah, I'm going to upload that clip now. I'm, well, not now. Probably. That's not my favorite. No, right? no, no, no. I'm not. I'm going to focus on Kim's off first. I'm going to upload this first. And then the other clip of you, what you made, I'll upload that tomorrow. Anyway, guys. Um, I appreciate the uh, upload a clip of him in adult section. Dickhead. 
Yeah, anyway, uh, to be fair, I lost that video. I don't even know where that video is. But yeah, anyway, um, guys, I appreciate you for stopping by. Uh, I'm going to catch you again probably tomorrow. Um, like I said, we're just going to keep the stream short. I do thank you all, uh, thank you very much for watching. And uh, like I said, shout out to everyone that um, came to join the stream. Rest in peace to uh, Keemstar once again. Condolences to his family. And until next time, I'm out. Peace.